guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video I know I'm a little late but I wanted to show you guys what I got for Black Friday and Cyber Monday I wanted to like get this out way sooner but some of my packages took forever to get here I only shop for myself but I just love watching these kind of videos I'm nosy I want to know what other people buy and what they get so I mean if you're interested then keep on watching you can see what I got Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the clothes just because I feel like I've already worn a lot of this. Like, I suck. As soon as I buy something, I just need to wear it like right away. So some of this you might have seen already like on my Instagram and stuff, but I'm still gonna show you anyways and let you know where I got it from. So yeah, I'm gonna just start with the stuff that I already took the tags off of. Um, so starting with American Eagle, cause that's, I think that's the only place I even shop for clothes. I got, first I got this sweater. It's like a cropped sweater. Um, and this really cute yellow color. I really like this sweater um, with the cute pair of like high-waisted jeans. It's really cute and comfy. And I just love American Eagle. It's a little bit more pricey. I honestly don't shop there until uh, there's like a discount or some kind of like offer going on. So yeah, for their Black Friday sale, they had 40% off everything. And then on Cyber Monday, they had 40% off everything plus 50% off sweaters. So yeah, I got this one. I also got this cardigan, which it's a little different. I mean, you'd either like something like this or you think it's completely hideous. It has like fringy, I don't know what you would call these. Uh, has like these stringy things hanging from the sleeves. I guess I could try it on. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I thought it was so cute. And I got this in an extra small and it fits really well. I think, wait, is it an extra small? Yeah, extra small slash small. I also got the one that I'm wearing right now, which is this one. I can show it to you guys really quick. I love sweaters and cardigans and stuff from um, American Eagle. I just think they're so cute and they're usually really good quality. And originally, did I keep the tags on any of this? No. Originally, I think these cardigans are like 48, 50. I ended up getting that for like 20 bucks, so I don't think that's bad at all. And then I also got a bunch of jeans from American Eagle. That's my favorite thing to get from American Eagle is their jeans. So whenever they're on sale, I just I just go in. Um, I guess I'll start with the ones I already wore. <laughs> so I got these. These ones are just like skinny, high waisted, and they have rips in them. They're really cute. The only thing I will say is that they're so high waisted that they almost like reach my boobs. <laughs> I have a really short torso anyways though, so I try to stay away from high-waisted stuff. But regardless, I wore this with like a longer shirt anyway, so you couldn't see the how high-waisted they were. But yeah, just beware, American Eagle has very high-waisted pants. And then I got these. These are probably my favorite pair that I got. Can you see them? They are like boyfriend jeans? Or girlfriend jeans? Or mom jeans? They are... They're the mom jeans. I like these because they're like a little bit looser, but they're not super loose either. Like, I don't know, I've tried a lot of boyfriend jeans and they're just too baggy for me. I like them to still be a little bit fitted and I feel like these mom jeans, they're like the perfect in between like a baggy pant and like a skinny pant. So the bottoms are skinny, but they're a little, they're a little bit looser like in the thigh and top area. So I just feel like it doesn't make my legs look so chickeny. Yeah. That doesn't make me look like I have such bad chicken legs. And then I got another pair. I think these are mom to mom jeans. It doesn't say, but they're either mom or girlfriend jeans. They're the only kinds I buy from American Eagle. I try to stay away, like I said, from their boyfriend jeans because they're a little bit too baggy for me. And I do have the price on these. So these were originally 50, so I think I ended up getting them for like 30 bucks, which is not bad at all for American Eagle jeans. Okay, and I got one more thing from American Eagle, but it's shoes, so I'm just gonna wait to show you guys those with the rest of the shoes that I'm gonna show you. Um, I also got this shirt from Hollister. I did wear this in one of my Instagram posts, but somehow I still kept the tag on it. So yeah, this shirt is $25, but I ended up getting it for 50% off. That was their Black Friday deal, and I got it for 12 bucks. I don't really shop at Hollister, but I was at Concord Mall and I just walked by and I saw their 50% off sale and I decided to peek in and I found this shirt and I think it's so cute, so trendy. But I also have these pants from American Eagle that I forgot to show. I actually haven't worn these ones yet. Um, these are jeggings. They're jeggings, right? Yeah. They're super stretch jeggings. And these were 50, these were 60, so I got them for like 40 bucks, I think. 
but they're just dark washed. They have rips on them. So that was all the clothes that I got, surprisingly. I actually didn't buy a lot of clothes. So next I'm gonna move on to the shoes. I think the shoes were my favorite part out of everything that I got. Oh my gosh, I got a lot of good shoes. Um, also, I apologize if I look a hot mess. I just got out of work, so I'm a little crusty. <laughs> I'm a little worn down. But these are the shoes that I got from American Eagle. They are so freaking adorable. I don't know if you guys see the little zipper that they have here with the circle. I love that. The chunky heel. They're so cute. I think the only thing with these though is that, I don't know if you guys can tell, but this part that goes around the ankle is so big and I have the tiniest ankles. I always have this problem with booties. Like I, I would have so many booties if it wasn't for the fact that they all fit my ankles ginormous. And I have like really tiny twiggy legs anyway. So yeah, if I wear these with like looser jeans like the mom and girlfriend jeans i was showing you i can make them work because they're a little bit looser on the bottom anyway so you can't really see my ankle but i literally have to have the jean sitting on top of this shoe so you can't see my little itty bitty anorexic ankle other than the ankle being super big on this one i do really love these boots they're so cute and they're red they're different i don't have any shoes that look like this okay so these next boots are my favorite oh my gosh i just i just love them like every time i look at them i'm just like wow these shoes are beautiful but yeah this is what they look like i love these boots so much i already wore them once they're not the most comfortable boots i've ever worn ever but like are half the shoes we wear comfortable no the heel is the perfect height for me they're not uncomfortable because of the heel they're uncomfortable because this top part is so pointed so i feel like my foot starts to hurt towards the front but other than that, I really love them. I still, like I worked with them all day one day and it wasn't too bad. They were uncomfortable, but it was nothing that bad. These were a little bit more pricey. I did get these from Steve Madden and I got like 30% off or 20% off, but they were still like a hundred bucks. The day I wore them, I got so many compliments on them. But yeah, I got them on Steve Madden. They are the Jillian booty. And I love them so much. I just had to get them in black as well. So here are the black ones. I wore these ones today for the first time and they're super cute as well. I got a lot of compliments on them. And then I also got a pair from DSW. These I also love, but they're these ones. Oh my gosh, tell me they aren't so freaking cute. I actually already wore these. Surprisingly, these are more comfortable than these ones were. And they were like a third of the price. These were only 30 bucks. I got them from DSW. They also had a sale. I think it was 30% off or 20% off. So I ended up grabbing these. And since they're platform, they're not that uncomfortable. Um, I mean, they're not the most comfortable pair of shoes ever, but they're really not that bad for how high they are. And that was all the shoes that I got. I got a lot of shoes. I'm obsessed with buying shoes. Like, <laughs> I have a problem. Okay, so I got through all the clothes. I got through all the shoes. So now I think we just have makeup. I really thought I had a lot more stuff. I mean it is a lot of stuff but i guess that i just thought i'd be sitting here for a lot longer so next i got some stuff from ulta so ulta had like 10 off of 50 i think and then they also had like 20 percent off and then i had points so they had a lot of good deals at ulta going on so the first thing i wanted to grab was some ofer lipsticks um they were 50 percent off the only thing I'm a little bit bummed out about is that they sent me two of the colors in the old packaging, which looks like this. And then they sent me one in the new packaging, and I, I really do like the new packaging a lot better. This is the color Havana Nights, and I'm so excited to use it. I'm gonna swatch it for you guys, because this color looks bomb. The other two are just like nudes, so it's like whatever. But this one's like a pretty orangey color. Actually, it's not Havana Nights. This is Miami Fever. I have Havana Nights on my lips right now. And I'm gonna swatch it. And Ofra's liquid lipsticks are bomb. Like, I really recommend them. I've bought so many within like a month. Oh my god, my swatch sucks, but. That's what this color looks like. So cute for the fall. Even though, like, is it winter yet? When does winter start? I don't know. But yeah, I do really recommend Ofra lipsticks. So, like, I'm not the biggest lash fanatic. I'm not the biggest lash fanatic but I do want to wear them more. I do really think they complete the look. So I got these two. I don't know who this chick is, but the lashes looked pretty and they were cheap. They were like four bucks. And then I also got a lash glue, nothing fancy. This one's from Kiss. Last but not least, I got this 
Makeup Revolution Concealer. I heard this is a really good dupe for the Tarte Shape Tape. I don't know if you guys can see this because my light is really bright. This concealer I heard is really good, so I'm excited to try it. I will let you guys know if I like it, and if it is a dupe for the Shape Tape, then that's gonna be amazing because this concealer was like $4. I think I did get it on sale, but still, it was like three, four bucks. Next, I got something from Morphe. Um, I got a brush set. This is the iBabe Faves. It's their 15 best selling eye brushes and I'm always doing crazy makeup looks. I like playing with color and stuff so I don't wash my brushes as often as I should and they're always dirty anyways. Like as soon as I wash them I use them right away. So I decided to stock up on some eye brushes since they did have 25% off on their website for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. So on the website they were 48 and with the discount code I think I got them for like 35 bucks which is not bad at all for 15 brushes. Um, yeah, there's a lot here. We have an eyebrow brush, a couple blending brushes, a flat brush, brushes for the under eye. We just have a really good variety of brushes. And yeah, but yeah, that's all I got from Morphe. Um, I just needed some brushes. That's why I even got anything from there. And then I think we're on my last package. Wow. I really thought that was gonna be a lot longer. And I'm gonna tell you guys now, I just got a bunch of lipsticks <laughs> because I'm a lipstick whore. I love lipsticks. Can I say whore on YouTube? I got eight lipsticks. And then the three that I got from Ulta, which is like excessive, I know. I got a couple shades. I kinda wanna show them to you, kinda don't because I feel like there's so many. What if I just take this lipstick off and put one on? I guess we could do that because I got a lot. Oh, and I got three of the ones from the I Love Saturday collaboration. Um, if you guys know who that is, she's a YouTuber and she did collaborate with them. But yeah, I got her three shades, which are in Peachy, New Chica, and Aesthetic. I'll try on one of them. Where's my mirror? I guess I'll just use this mirror. I'm going to try... This one in the shade Aesthetic, because I think this was the darker lipstick that she came out with. Oh, and the packaging is really cute. It's different from Dose's original packaging. Can you see it? Because I know. So, that's what this looks like. Super cute. Ah. It kind of looks like the shade that I swatched from Ofra, the Miami Nights one. Miami Fever, I think, not Miami Nights. Wow, I love this color, oh my God. I didn't apply it super evenly or nicely because I didn't have a lip liner or anything. But yeah, wow, I love it. It's like a really pretty like orangey color, orangey brown. But yeah, I got a lot of those Dose of Color lipsticks. Um, I want to do a video showing you guys my favorite lipsticks, so maybe I'll do that soon. I don't know. I have so many video ideas in my dang head. I need to just like do them and then think of more ideas. Okay, so that was everything that I got. Um, I did get a lot of stuff, but I feel like I found a lot of good deals. I love shopping. I could shop all day long. If you guys did like this video, let me know. I would love to do a lot more hauls. I'm always shopping anyway, so I might as well show you guys what I like, but only if you want to see it. Mom, if you're watching this, don't judge me because I know you were judging me when all these packages started coming in. You were like, what, why, more stuff? And I was like, yeah, more stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I had so much fun doing it. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye.